Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. This customer's truck only has 882 miles on it, and the customer brought it in because the check engine light is on and it won't stay running. The technician found that a valve stem broke on cylinder 8. He said he is replacing the engine under warranty with a new long block due to damage on the piston. Customer states that their transmission suddenly grenaded. The technician said they believed that the customer was hauling a trailer that was too heavy for the truck, since it's used to tow for a construction company. This vehicle came in because their battery kept dying. The technician working on this vehicle also noticed that the front brakes were non-existent, a brake line disconnected from the ABS module and the front tires to be very worn. This 2022 Jeep Wrangler Hybrid only has 15 miles on it and was brought in for a coolant leak. The technician found this coolant hose disconnected, which is supposed to be connected to one of the electric coolant pumps for the high voltage system. Customer states, hybrid warning coming on and off, and car won't start. Battery was also replaced according to the customer. These are all the codes that came up, and the technician found the hybrid battery swimming in water in the trunk of the vehicle. The customer declined all repairs and unfortunately didn't have insurance to cover the cost. Customer states their car sounds like a helicopter. This 2022 Jeep Wagoneer only has 1,700 miles on it, and the customer came in to get the steering wheel replaced due to the material separating from the steering wheel. Customer states sunroof won't close. The technician found a shell casing stuck in the sunroof track, which prevented the sunroof from closing. This is after the customer installed a new battery. The technician found out that the customer installed a new battery that was too small and left the battery hole down loose. The battery slid in the tray and the terminals touched the hole down, which shorted the battery. Is this factory for this year? The technician said this person came running in and said her car was on fire and asked if they could help. She apparently drove the car to the dealership while it was on fire. This vehicle just came in for an oil change, and this happened when the technician lifted up the vehicle in the hoist. This is a 1965 Austin Mini Moke. It has 34 horsepower and the top speed is 68 miles per hour. The viewer who sent this in said it's the most fun you can have on four wheels without breaking the speed limit. If you've enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like or subscribing, and you can submit your clips at justrolledinyt.com. Thanks for watching.